Hi, my name is Giuliano Prieto, a general engineering contractor with Prieto Engineering in Los Angeles, California. And today, I will show you how to stop moisture in a concrete floor. As a second generation concrete contractor, I know all too well how to prevent moisture in a concrete floor. And it all begins prior to even placing any concrete. For the purpose of demonstration, imagine that this is the perimeter of the home. The first step in preventing moisture in a concrete floor is to place a layer of sand, anywhere from about an inch and a half to two inches. Once you are done spreading the first two inches of sand, then you are ready for the next step, which is taking a roll of six millimeter plastic, start on one edge, and lay it all the way across the entire area of the home. Now, if you need more than one piece of plastic, which you probably will, what I want you guys to do is take a piece of heavy duty tape and place it over any areas that are lapped. I want you to take the visqueen or the plastic and overlay it about six inches, one over the other. Also, use the heavy duty tape to cover any puncture holes that may occur during the construction process prior to placing the concrete. The final step in preventing any moisture in a concrete floor is to add another layer of sand over the plastic that has been laid down. Ensure that not too much time or too many days have elapsed in between this process because the plastic is very susceptible to the sun's rays and begins to deteriorate. If I was on a real construction site, what we would probably have is a bobcat bring in, or a track loader, bring in the sand, create a pile, and then we would spread it out with a landscape rake. We are now protected from any moisture that wants to come up through the subgrade and into the concrete and eventually moisten the concrete floor. My name is Giuliano Prieto with Prieto Engineering, and I thank you for watching my video on how to prevent moisture in a concrete floor.